On the evening of Saturday, April 20th, Lions Club members, family, and friends gathered at Boulder Point Golf Club for the annual Lion races. Attendees enjoyed a taco bar and took part in raffles and had a chance to win some real money. Local businesses and organizations sponsored 24 wooden lions and had fun decorating them. Each line was given odds and advanced down the track thanks to large fuzzy dice. Yeah, so we, we went to local businesses. We have 24 lions. They purchase a lion from us and they decorate it however they want with their company logos and everything. And uh, we have a best dressed lion award. So people in the crowd here are, are voting on their favorite lion. And then uh, we'll, we'll start the races. We line up the races, line up six lions in a row. There are eight races plus a championship. And we roll big fuzzy dice. And whatever dice numbers come up, they, those two lions move forward a space until we have a winner at the end after eight spaces. The first Lions races were held in 2015 at the Knights of Columbus Hall on Orion Road. The event has since moved to Boulder Point Golf Club in Oxford and attendance was up significantly this year. I All I can say is thank you so much for supporting this um, event because all the money we raise goes back to our community. I see a big banner that has sponsors on it too. What do you want to say to the sponsors? Uh, I want to thank all the sponsors because without them none of this would happen and they've done a great thing by sponsoring us. On a sad note, longtime Lions Club member Bob Erickson passed away on April 9th at the age of 72 after a courageous battle with cancer. We're really, really, really sad about that one. Bob is, uh, I know personally, he's one of my favorite people, one of the best men I've known in my life. Um, he's been a Lion a long, long time and uh, really in, in an inspiration to many of us in the club. He helped me a lot as a mentor when I was president of the club. Uh, just one of the one of the best, most generous people in our community. Bob Erickson was a fantastic lion. He was a great member of this community, and he is going to be sorely, sorely missed. That he's wonderful. What were some of his responsibilities? What causes were near and dear to him? Bob um, worked a lot on Project Kids Sight, which is testing, you know, kids for their eyes. Um, he was involved in everything, just everything. He was wonderful. We have many different things that we support. One of the biggest things that we do is a Christmas basket program, and we feed about 215 families with two weeks' worth of groceries over Christmas and about 80 single senior citizens. And then we have lots of other Project Kids site. We support Leader Dog for the Blind. Um, we, if somebody is in need that needed eyeglasses, we would do that. We've just started a new program, it's called Defense Against Diabetes, because diabetes is a leading cause of blindness. And so we're putting money behind programs that, that promote the prevention of diabetes. We here at ONTV offer our condolences to the friends and family of Bob Erickson. He will be greatly missed. 